The Nashville Soundbite presents This Week in Country Music, February 7th through 13th. This week in 2020, Miranda Lambert played a concert in Dallas where her alma mater, Lindale High School Choir, backed her on The Tin Man. Miranda told us of the 2018 ACM Song of the Year. The Tin Man, I guess going through a lot of times where I felt pretty empty, I understood a whole new meaning. I mean, how many times have we seen The Wizard of Oz, you know? But it's something that the world shares. Is Everyone knows what the Tin Man represents cold and empty and loneliness and heartless and it just opened my eyes to it even more going through pain myself. This week in 2010, Carrie Underwood sang the national anthem at the Super Bowl, a 31-17 New Orleans Saints win over the Indianapolis Colts at Miami's Sun Life Stadium. Carrie has always been a football fan. I grew up watching football you know, from from birth. I mean, I'm from Oklahoma. We're we're a football state, and uh, it's just a part of the country that everybody has their teams, and it's there's such an energy about it. We we would drive down to Dallas and, and watch the Cowboys play um, whenever we could, and there's just something about being at a live sporting event. There's an excitement to it that really. I mean, it's, it's unlike anything else. So, and being a part of the Super Bowl is especially amazing because that's just, that's just the, the biggest of the big. This week in 1988, Barbara Mandrell, Reba McIntyre, and George Strait topped the list of nominees in the Music City News Awards. Little did Reba know at the time she would become a major host of country award shows. She recently said of her hosting duties, then the adrenaline of the show, the night of the show. It's, uh, you were either running short, running long, adjust, make sure that I am on my mark and I have everything ready to go. I love live television because you never know what's going to happen. This week in 1980, Loretta Lynn sang Y'all Come in an episode of CBS TV's The Dukes of Hazard, backed by the show's cast. <laughs> 